What up guys, Shifty here, back again with another review and today we're gonna review the Scupa the Vego sent in by Storm Riders Wheel. So yes, what you're looking at right now is one of the cars from the Spider-Man series uh, for 2017-2018. So check this out, this is a chase piece car. If you take a look right here, these are all of the cars technically for the series this is the secret seven car although it's not really that secret it's kind of easy to find you know this chase piece it's just a marketing strategy but anyways let's take a look at this scupa di fago right here uh this is actually i actually like this kind of fantasy casting i have a couple of this a uh, couple variations of this car in my collection and it's a pretty cool uh, looking car it's a future futuristic looking car I'm not sure, but it does resemble one car in real life. I can't quite put my finger on it. But check this out. It's like a really low car. Some jet termites in the rear. And uh, oh, look at that. The window is part of the red pipes right here. It's a one plastic piece. I guess it's like for some nitro or something. I don't know. So on the hood, we do get Spider-Man right there, the logo. And the Spider-Man logo right there, established 2017. And I love how... The spider web is the pattern for the car. You can see there is a spider web that spider web that's like covering covering the car. So that's a really nice uh, design feature right there. And one thing I notice is on the right side you can see it's the spider web, Spider Man logo. But on the left side we do get the Marvel Marvel uh, twenty uh, seventeen uh, thing right there. Oh man, I really hate it when Hot Wheels does this for the car. Why can't they just put it behind or something? You know. But anyways, this is the Scupa the Fago. I'm not a really huge fan of this car. Maybe if gray, I don't really like gray. It looks dull on this car. But the red tint and the red trim around this car is pretty cool. I give it a 7.5 out of 10. 